Hello and welcome to this tutorial on Shopify Odoo application. In this video, I'm going to show you how to export or update stock from Odoo to Shopify. To do that, go to Shopify application. Now before exporting or updating the stock from Odoo to Shopify, we'll have to set few configuration for the stock management. To do that, go to configuration and settings. Select the instance from the drop down menu and go to stock information. So over here we have stock field. So what this means is what type of stock do you want to export or update from Odoo to Shopify? We have two types of stock. One is free to use quantity, which we recommend. And the second is forecast quantity. So let me explain you what is free to use quantity. Free to use quantity means quantity on hand minus reserved quantity. And the second is the forecast quantity, which means quantity on hand minus outgoing plus the incoming. So I have selected free to use quantity and click on save. So let's go to the Shopify store. Let's go to products. I have two products, bicycle and bottle where the stock value is zero. I would like to update the stock value of bicycle and bottle from my Odoo to Shopify. So let's go to the Odoo. Let's go to the inventory application, products and products. As you can see, I have the product bicycle and bottle where the stock value is 20 and 50. So let's export these two values from my Odoo to Shopify. You can export the stock value from Odoo to Shopify in two ways. One is manually and second is automatically. So let's start with exporting the stock value manually from Odoo to Shopify. So for that, go to the Shopify application. Go to perform operation. From the drop down menu, select export stock. Over here, we have a field called export stock from. Let me explain to you what does this field means. Let's consider three products, product A, product B and product C. Product A's last stock movement was on the 1st of February. Product B last stock movement was on 1st of March and product C last stock movement was on 10th of March. Now when I'm exporting the stock from Odoo to Shopify manually, if I set the date to 1st of March, it is only going to update the stock of product B and product C. It will not update the stock for product A. Let's consider a case scenario where I have a massive product catalog of around 5000 products and I have made the stock movement for only 100 products. Now when updating the stock from Odoo to Shopify store, it will only consider the stock movement made by those 100 products and not updating the stock for the remaining products in which the stock movement has not been updated. This way, it runs the application in the more effective manner and it doesn't hamper the performance of the Odoo nor of the Shopify store. And click on execute. This is going to export the stock value from Odoo to Shopify. So let's go to the Shopify store. Let's refresh the page. As you can see, the stock value has been updated for my bicycle and for my product bottle. Apart from exporting all the stock value from my warehouse to my Shopify store, in our application, we also have a feature where you can set certain percentage of the stock from the warehouse to be exported from your warehouse to the Shopify store. Let's consider a case scenario where I have multiple sales channels apart from my Shopify store. I would like to reserve certain quantity for my Shopify store and certain quantity for my sales channel when I'm managing a single warehouse. To do that, let's go to our Shopify application. Let's go to products and products. Let's consider the product hand sanitizer. Let's go to variant menu and open the record hand sanitizer. Over here we have fixed stock type. You can either set it to fix or percentage. So let's consider percentage and let's consider how much percentage of the stock value you would like to export from your warehouse to the Shopify store. 
So let's, for my case, I'm going to keep it as 50% and click on save and click on save. So let's go to the inventory app, go to products and products, go to hand sanitizer. As you can see, the stock value is 50. So now when I update the stock value from my Odoo to Shopify, it is only going to update 25 stock quantity. So now let's update the stock quantity. To do that, go to the Shopify application, go to products and products, select the product hand sanitizer and click on export stock. This is going to export the stock for only hand sanitizer product. Click on export stock manually. So now let's go to the Shopify store, refresh the page. As you can see, only 25 of the stock value has been exported from my Oru to Shopify. Apart from this, if you wish to export this stock from Oru to Shopify automatically, we also have that feature. To export the stock automatically, go to configuration and instance, select the instance, go to configure scheduler, click on export stock. Set certain time frame. Let's say in my case, I would like to set 25 minutes. I would like to export the stock from today and click on save. Once you click on save, it is going to export or update the stock every 25 minutes from my Odoo to Shopify store. 